The reason that people on prednisone struggle so much with sleep is because studies show that just one dose of steroids, prednisone, dexamethasone, and others, is enough to throw off your sleep-wake cycle. Normally, you make cortisol in the morning, which is what prednisone is mimicking, and then at night you make melatonin. And they're in this beautiful rhythm. One is high while the other one goes high. So in the morning you get cortisol, and in the evening you get melatonin released. And that's your vampire hormone that helps you feel tired and want to fall asleep. But when you're not having a normal dose of cortisol because you're throwing it off by taking prednisone and it's off the charts, then the melatonin can't keep up and it actually falls below. So you're actually making less melatonin even though you have more cortisol. The whole system is thrown off. So what you need to do if you want to get restful sleep is to give it back give back the melatonin and not just the melatonin which is one of the key ingredients in my bedtime neutronized zone but also you need the building blocks for melatonin so that that little bit that you do make you can actually make it because you have the ingredients to make it and another thing that prednisone is stealing is called magnesium magnesium you must have in order to create melatonin and so another fantastic ingredient in neutronized zone bedtime is magnesium glycinate. And not only does magnesium help build melatonin, but the glycinate part that's attached to is an amino acid that crosses the blood brain barrier and helps you feel calm so that you can calm down that racing prednisone brain and feel like you're able to actually fall asleep instead of just having the thoughts racing and so much pressure in your brain.